<laughs> it's never gonna come on. <laughs> Are you tired of spending countless times trying to fix your PS4 controller because the yellow light keeps constantly coming on? Well, do not worry because show you how, which is me, I'll be showing you how to fix the yellow light of death that you keep constantly getting on your PS4 controller right now. Okay, so first things first, guys. You wanna make sure you have your PS4 controller, of course, because that's what we're trying to fix. And you wanna make sure your PS4 is fully off, but do not unplug the um, power cord to it. And you wanna make sure you already have your USB cable for your PS4 controller already plugged in. And I want you to go ahead and plug your PS4 controller in. Do not, do not turn your PS4 on yet, just wait. And now once you have that plugged in, now you can turn on your PS4. And as it's turning on, hold on. You should get a light like that, a yellow light, but it's gonna be like a long light. And guys, what we're basically doing is we're trying to make your PS4 realize what your controller is, because your controller, I mean, your PS4 does not recognize your controller. So that's what we're trying to do is make your PS4 recognize the controller. So for some reason, it just doesn't. So you just have to wait. You just want to wait till it loads up on the screen. I'm going to show you. Wait till your PS4 fully turns on on your TV first. All right. So once you have it turned on all the way and you get to that welcome back to PlayStation screen, what I want you to do is I want you to hold the PS4 um button until you hear two clicks. So another click, you want to let go. All right. So let go after you hear that second click and just wait. That's when you just put this right here and just wait. And you should see like a few blinks as it's turning off, but don't do anything yet. Just wait until it turns off fully. Until you see this light right here. You see how it's blinking a little bit? You want to wait till it turns off fully. And then I'll show you the next the next step of what to do. And you see my PS4 controller just turned off. But wait till your PS4 fully turns off. And you see it just fully turned off because the lights, none of the um lights are on. So what I want you to do now is, hold on. What I want you to do is just tap the button once and just wait. Just wait. And you should get a like just like that. But that is good because we're trying to get your PS4 to recognize your PS4 controller. Because for some reason, the, um, the PS4 controller does not recognize it sometimes. So we're trying to reconnect it back. And just wait. And wait till the screen loads up again. Just wait. All right, so it's loading up. It says, welcome back to PlayStation again. So what we're going to do now is, I want you to get your PS4 controller. I want you to unplug it, right? And right when you unplug it, the light is gonna go off. And just wait, so. When you plug it back up, right when you plug it back up, I want you to start hitting that um, PS4 controller button, the PS button right there, right when you plug it up. So just keep hitting it, just like that. And your PS4 controller should come on. And as you see on the screen right now, my users are on there. So, you know, my PS4 controller just connected to it. So that is how you fix the yellow light, the PS4 controller, yellow light of death on your PS4 controller. And if, you, if this method didn't work for you, I have more tutorials on my channel. I will make a playlist so you can just go through the playlist and and um, use all those videos to see if they work for you. But that's pretty much the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you go ahead and drop a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And we'll be back to show you how.